talking this with King Yellow. Um, we got Charleston White. Y'all know I be really tripping with Charleston. I don't be taking him serious though, but uh, I'm gonna talk about Charleston White speaking on Lil J on Say Cheese. He say Lil J moving backwards. Y'all hear that? I really, I don't agree with Charleston on a lot of things, but what I agree with him on is he's saying Lil J need to reconstruct itself, restructure itself. So, meaning what he's saying is Lil J did seven years. He said he moving backwards, 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 backwards. You did seven years in prison, double O, and you coming home on the same thing from seven years ago. Meaning the dissing, niggas done lost niggas, niggas gang banging, niggas dead, niggas gone, ain't nothing the same. So I feel what Charleston saying, cause at the end of the day, I just did four. And I'm not the same, I don't feel the same like, yeah, my homie's gone, but this and the nigga, another nigga that's dead or whatever, that ain't gonna bring my homies back or even continuing, continuing the war, not gonna bring my homies back. That's just gonna make a motherfucker lose more homies. We losing, they losing, both sides losing. There ain't no win situation. What you gonna do? Keep killing until a nigga dead? You gotta realize this. When we went to jail seven years ago, niggas that was 15, Lil J, they 22 now. When I went to jail, the same thing. So it's new youngest that's coming out. Like, you got little shoebox baby and all these. They was kids. These is babies. Now they from old blockers. There's new members coming from every hood, though. You feel me? So at the end of the day, I know what, what Charleston saying is Lil J, he talented enough to. I know, because Lil J got songs where he don't. He don't diss, but I understand, you know, the dissing and all that. That's the attention. That's what sells. That's what the fans want to hear. They want to hear the bullshit. They don't want to hear no positivity. They don't want to hear nothing. Nothing that's going to uplift. But I understand what the OG nigga saying. I give him that. I give you that, Charleston. Because I feel the same way. We can do, we can, don't have them look at us as one way. You feel me? We versatile. I know Lil J versatile. I know Building are versatile. I know J Main versatile. Like I told FYB J Main, bro, fuck all that dissing shit. Get these people music, cause these people, these labels not finna keep picking up niggas that's promoting motherfuckers to die. Cause that's basically what's going on. So uh Charleston saying he moving backwards. What y'all think? Y'all think he moving backwards or he moving forward? He taking off? But he's taking off on the same path from seven years ago. Even coming home doing interviews, talking. I wanna don't no need to talk about seven years ago. That's like me coming home and still speaking on the offset and Cardi B situation. Like that's in the past. Like you leave the past in the past. Like, you know what I'm saying? You have it's growth. You have to you have to move forward, man. You have to wanna do better. You feel me? Especially for the youth. We got kids that's looking up to this shit. We can't continue to do the same thing. One thing for sure is doing the same thing, you're going to get the same results. Ain't nothing changed. Doing this, doing that same shit, guess what happened? Niggas go to jail. Niggas die. You feel me? Niggas get shot. Niggas stuck in a... It's the same thing. I ain't saying I'm perfect at all, gang, because I'm far from perfect. But what I can say about myself is, like, I know I done better. I still, I, I, I better myself, but I still need help in certain parts, of, you feel me, in life that, you know, that I'm still working on, you know. But fathers, like, we only human. Like, I understand Dirk and them, they, they drop their songs and the whole world. And you want to get your get back, you feel me? That's for both sides. Me, I'm older, and... It still happened to me. I don't have, nigga, I'm tripping. Fuck, whole ass niggas and whoop, whoop, But then I still got people in my ear. Like, what the fuck is you doing? Whoop, whoop. See, when you got somebody, you, some, you, everybody, everybody got a yes man, but sometimes you need a no man. You need somebody to tell you no. 
Every, you don't need nobody or everybody around to just say, yeah, 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 yeah. You need somebody to tell you, your song trash. You need somebody to tell you, bro, take that down. You need somebody to tell you, don't put that out. If a nigga just said, yeah, yeah, he's a dick sucker. Oh, yeah, <laughs> yeah. But they don't even understand what come with it. They don't understand the consequence. They don't understand that some of these videos, y'all can say what y'all want. Yeah, it's in the streets, but niggas get mad when a song come out and it's making them look bad. You feel me? So now it's like, damn, what I'm some type of bitch ass nigga. Yeah, the duck situation. You feel me? The duck situation, you know, all that shit was in the street, but when that dead bitches came out, it was like, oof. I know niggas couldn't take it. You feel me? So y'all gotta catch that drift. But uh yeah, man. Uh Charleston, I like when you I like when you speaking like this. Don't talk about the youth and degrade them. Uplift them and tell them where you fucking up at. Don't say nigga you need you deserve to die or that bitch ass nigga had what he had coming or he deserved to be in jail. Why don't you talk to the youth and tell these people Go another route. Help a motherfucker. That's what's wrong with us. We don't help each other. We don't uplift each other. We, some people need help. Some people need to sit down and, and conversate. Some people really watch my videos because I'm talking to them and they feel like I'm talking to them. Because in reality, I'm talking to y'all. Y'all might not be on here right now, but when y'all watch this, uh, this message is for y'all. It's not for me. I can talk to myself. I can talk to my girl. I can talk to the kids if I want to. You feel me? But my thing is, if I can help another person, I'm doing good, and it, it feel good to myself, you feel me, if I can help a young brother that's going through problems in the trenches, that's confused if he want to play basketball, or if he want to grab a Glock and pop a nigga, you never know, and where I really get this from, salute Pac, man, Pac was the realest nigga on earth to me, yeah, he did what he did, that's the same shit with me, I did what I did, but when it come to, when it come to the youth, you feel me? And mothers and shit like that, grandmamas and shit like that, you know. You know, they got a, you know, soft spot. You feel me? So, it is what it is. It ain't nothing to be ashamed of at all. Be human. You feel me? So, you know, double O, you know, still a little bro, man, you know. I want the best for you, man, you know. Make sure you calculate every step. Make sure you you think before every move. And I know you smart. I know you far from an idiot. You feel me? They might think, oh, he he fucked up. Lil Jay's smart, bro. He was, went to school. He he know he know what was going on, man. He far from an idiot. So don't don't get it messed up, bro. For real. But uh yeah, man. Like, comment, subscribe, share. Tell me what y'all what y'all think, what y'all feel right down here in the comment section. Y'all know what's going on. Talking this with King Yellow, King Yellow, the great show. Let's go.